the um, effects I'm feeling now from uh, this Detura and LSD use. LSA, I mean, I search gas in my I am uh, finding myself more of like a dream state, like a little bit of a delu delirious, like, um, wonder. I really can't stand to think of myself as being somebody who's just on an outward limits of being, you know, expressive with, with, uh, with any other people. Like, that would be something that I would consider possibly dangerous, you know, at uh, any extent, at any rate. It really doesn't comply with what it, it um, makes a difference with what uh, is, um, what can be, and what we can accomplish uh, forward and on to and uh, to keep on bringing about. And um, the tonic structure, the uh, the amount of work that it came in together from the beginning was hours, processes, hours, long processes of recording music and trying to find the right tone to go into it, which took a long time to be able to even uh, come up to the recordings that it has come up to be now. And still the recordings are not what they should be. Uh, I wish that they were something completely different, something more, and something more elaborate and very uh, um, metaphorical. I want the lyrics to flow together correctly, but at this point, um, I'm just waiting for more members to join with tonic structure. The uh, the band itself is is actually uh, coming together quite well so far with me and Michael Benzer. He's uh, the he's on uh, bass and vocals, and me myself I'm the guitarist and the lead singer here. Well, singer so far I I don't need to find more. But um, Reese Bello is the other guitarist, and then we got a. Uh, uh, another person who's up with lyrics and uh, raps and comes up with some uh, uh, interesting beats and stuff like that. Uh, Brandon Daney, and then um, the possibilities of Nick and all that. And, but anyway, the main ideal here about tonic structure is it, it started way, way back when, in you know, 2010, and um, from 2010 worked on its way to um, coming out with an album of uh, Tonic Structure's Time which has 101 songs of all the music that was created since the very beginning to this very end of this era of music that will be changing now that we have more people and the new additions to it. And so these new additions will um, definitely, they will uh, um, increase the creative potential that this uh, band is hoping to accomplish and uh, hoping to get our message out there. And our message is very clear. It's a simple one of peace but also one of, you know, that is at some point some songs of resentfulness towards certain people from what has happened, but I mean, with any creative potential, with any person, you'll find that uh, they'll add those certain kind of uh, uh, elements into their music, and uh, my elements that I add were more uh, mindsets in general, and I try to make it more feeling like the music like you could feel it as an emotion more so than uh, try to do it try to detach with it um, on a lyrical level in the beginning however and then that changed into more of a radical uh, strange wave format that I made time and then um, put that all together